Well, overall, it's just made people engage. If you go into a classroom and you can't see what's on the screen, you're not going to stay in that class or pay attention. So it's really engaged students and allowed them to be in the class and be able to see what the lecturer is trying to teach. For a large lecture group like this group here, which can be up to 250 students, I combine the overhead data projector with the visualizer and it tends to bring to life the calculations which otherwise the students would not see. And students learn by doing and, and if they see somebody else doing it, it's even better again. And the size of the screen is also crucial because uh, it's a big lecture, lecture theatre and if they're very far back then vision is a problem. And when we were using the, the whiteboard, using markers, the whiteboard is like a postage stamp if you're sitting in the back row of the lecture theatre. Students now, with the gear they use, they expect the very best. So when you have good gear, they up their expectation of what you're doing. And uh, it just doesn't just, just affect what they're seeing on the screen, but also what they expect from you. And they're more inclined to be involved or anything else. Not going to affect everybody. So the university is investing just over 200 million in a new campus development plan. So part of that is a key transformation of the IT infrastructure, including audiovisual equipment in the teaching spaces in the university. And to date we've been using old halogen technology. So we want to move from that old technology to a new technology that's consistent across all campuses, all teaching spaces. So the laser technology offered by Panasonic was attractive from the quality it offers, the extremely long life, and overall from a university perspective, the substantially reduced cost of ownership. In Irish terms, a no-brainer. DCU are they're well ahead of the curve. The future thinking not only from the teaching perspective but also from the technology perspective. So um, while they're embracing the new teaching methods of flipped learning and collaborative workspaces, they're also saying, right, maintenance, you know, what, what are our maintenance costs going to be in that? So they've gone with the laser projectors, they've also given us very stri stringent uh, turnaround times for failure, so we have a two-hour response time. Using Using the, the lasers gives us peace of mind that we're not going to have lamp errors. We had technology that wasn't always reliable, uh, slow startup uh, times, whatever, and it was very important in the context of our ambitions for a 21st century digital campus that our AV equipment be brought up to date and be state of the art.